And for the starting lineups, we'll go to our PA announcer, who's been here for 31 years announcing. For the Central, I don't know if you know this, Matt, they won the Sycamore shootout during Thanksgiving. They wanted to play us. They were hoping to play us, and uh, they were nervous to play us as well. I talked to several of their fans. Newer coming out wearing the black. Uh, they're going left to right. They're the away team. They look pretty sharp out there. We're ready to start this game. 32 minutes left of basketball. And it looks like... Newark, Stevie pulls out the jump ball. That, there was a scramble for it. Willie bringing the ball up. We'll try to remember, we don't have video. We have audio only. Willie posting up, looking underneath. He's looking for a pass, drops it off to his brother. He's at 15 feet on the far wing. Willie driving, looking. Gives it over to Evan. Evan looking for a shot at 15. Drives in, nothing doing. Jack, now we're gonna take reset things. Jack directing traffic, just like a point guard. Jack does a nice job handling the ball if he needs to. Willie's got it on top. Again, Jack talking, gives it over to Stevie. Cameron posting up, we don't see that often. Evan on top, back over to Willie. 7-18 remaining in the first quarter. No shots have been taken. Newark's had the ball, nice curl by Jack. Oh, nice reverse spin. Oh, boy. No fouls, a lost ball that goes over to the Rockets. Here come the Rockets, and they're not messing around. Cam gets a tip, doesn't get it. He's d up. Norseman coming out in a 3-2. Jack standing there, he does a loop-de-loop -loop underneath. The Rockets take an early lead, two to nothing, six fifty-four remaining. Willie bringing the ball, barking some orders out, gives it off to Evan. Cameron, oh, he was wide open. He's got a Cameron a six-five. He's got a about a five-eleven, five-ten guy on. Cameron drives, loops it, nothing, gets his own rebound. No, misses the layup. I'll tell you what, he needs to take it to the hole, Matt. He does. Take it strong to the basket. He's got a shorter kid on him. He's got the advantage. Take that ball and go to the basket. Draw the foul and go to the foul line. They mark him at 5'10". I think he's really like 5'6". Norseman trapping in the corner. Nice trap. Cameron's got can't fall asleep underneath. Oh, oh near stutter steps and yep. the ref gets. Oh, three seconds. I thought the outside ref got the travel, but we'll take the three-second call anyway. Two to nothing early lead for the Rockets. Good call by my buddy Steve Lakin down there on the baseline. Three seconds in the lane. You don't see that very often in varsity basketball. No, you don't. Matt, you are a referee, and I forgot to... Comment about that earlier. Matt is a fellow ref out here, so he'll help us out. I know that I, Tom and I do a great job refing from up here. All Norseman fans do a great job refing. Jack with a nice double nice. spin move. Bucket. He created that by himself. It's all tied with 557 remaining in the first quarter. Here come the Rockets. Norseman trapping. Willie gets a tip off. Nothing doing. Rockets contain it. They're on top. Skip pass over to the wing. They're on the far wing. Rockets going right to left. Evan coming out guarding 15 feet. He backs him in. Evan, nice defense, keeping his body still. Jack with a big defensive rebound. Here come the Norsemen. Stevie has it. Up the wing to 
Willie, Willie looking. Gives it off to Big Jack. Jack thinking about a three. Nothing doing. Lost his dribble. Shouldn't use that. Cameron standing over in the corner by himself. He Remember, he's got the shorter point guard on him. I'm not sure why they're doing that defense, but we need to exploit that. Willie has it on top. Guarded. Skip pass to Cameron. Cameron, 15-footer. Bang. Beautiful shot. Great ball movement by the Norseman to exploit the defense there. Norseman showing a 3-2 zone. High screen of Willie. Nothing doing. Cameron out deep, and he bodies him up a little too much. Little bit of body. Got him with the block there. That's his first. That's the first of the, of the game. Cameron nearly gets a tip out on the taken out. Five minutes remaining in the first quarter. Four to two, Norseman with the early lead. Three-point attempt from the corner. Jack might have got him. Nothing doing. Stevie pulls down the rebound. Here come the Norseman. Willie has it. Evan kind of in Willie's way, actually. Evan gives it out to Stevie. Stevie looking. Almost loses it. Gives it out to Cameron. Cameron over to Jack. Jack is on the far wing. Willie looking to post up, and they're really hammered. Oh, Willie had him posted. They got to oh. give it to him early. Evan for three from the side. Nothing doing, and it bounces up high and out of bounds. Over the top of the backboard, that's out of bounds. Boy, Newark missed a couple of inside shots there. Man, Willie was wide open, had a beautiful post play. 4.30 remaining. They're, here they come. Norseman staying with the 3-2. Norseman will go 3-2. They'll go man-to-man. -man. They'll go a 1-2-2. Two, two. They go a full-court press, a three-quarter court press. Oh, the miscommunication by the Rockets nearly threw it away. They were able to recover. They got them on the t wing. Jack quickly out there. Run, run, slide, slide, as my college coach told me. Oh, they're driving in strong. Evan there. Rebound, Evan. Nice defense by Evan. Cameron came over with the help defense as well. Two people getting ready to check in for the Rockets. Willie again posting up. He's got great posts. I can't believe we didn't get a foul or, or even a post up. We got to pass it in there. Willie's got him sealed again. Oh. Got to do it quickly. And Schmidt getting ready to set in. W Willie from 17, no good. He's got to take that shot inside. Driving in, and he was driving fast and quick, and Willie just stood with his hands in the air. They've got it on top, the Rockets, now to the wing. Throw it into their big guy. Jack with good defense, keep your hands up. Willie That's strips it. it, and who's going to come up with it? Oh. Loose ball, out of bounds. They're going to give it to the Rockets. There was about four guys that touched that ball as it went flying to the end line. Yeah, it could have been anybody's ball. Schmidt checks in for Cameron. They're going a little bit smaller, but a little bit quicker. Newark's got to make sure and keep those guys out of the lane. Three-point, long three-point shot. Schmidt, yep. he's on the line. Good job by Schmidt. He boxed him out. He, the ball, it was long shots equal long rebounds, oh. as Jerry Thornton used to teach us. And Norseman retained possession. Turnover on Burlington. And Rick Dawson uses a timeout. Do you remember last night? How many timeouts did he use in that first quarter? Do you remember? He used four timeouts four in time the first outs. quarter. I thought, oh, boy, we better save a couple of those for the second half. Well, he had one left within <laughs> one minute of uh, the game, and he used it. Uh, so he got his money's worth of his timeouts. He, I talked to him. When did I talk to him? This morning or, or, yes, or last night? I, talk, I interviewed him last night. We just sat and talked for, for quite a while. And he said, if I had 12 timeouts, I would have taken them all. <laughs> uh, uh, he, he also commented, he said, that, Phil, is, is the toughest team, I think, that I have ever coached against. Even Rockford Christian, back when Kyle and, and John lost wow. here at Plano Christmas, yeah. Christmas uh, Classic. Norseman taking it out. Here they come, Willie. Little, now they're doubling up. And Willie throws it away, and that is uncharacteristic. Oh, boy. We're averaging only about 9.5 turnovers a game. Norsemen are still leading 4-2, 3.05 to remaining in the first quarter. Has not been an offensive game for either team so far. No, really slow start for both teams. Norsemen still guarding out high on a 3-2. They're swinging the ball. Norsemen doing a nice job of retreating, helping on the weak side. They're really keeping an eye on that weak side. Great job. Evans in the middle of the lane. Nice little step around. And Evan just jumped about six days, or excuse me, Schmitty jumped about six days early. They rebounded over it and oh, yeah. scored a two-point. The shortest guy on the court got his own rebound. Four to four. 
2.25 remaining. Evans got it on top. Looking for it. Jack cutting. Doesn't get it to him. Willie's got it on top. Plenty of time. Jack's controlled. Don't get too anxious, Norseman. That's got to be a foul underneath. Willie can take him. He can. He's one of our best post players, and he misses a layup, but it was a beautiful move. We can do more of that. Norseman right back out. Travel. It was either going to be a travel or a stolen ball. We were hoping not a foul. That's right. Anytime the referee raises his hands when a guy goes into the lane like that, you hope for not a foul. Yep. Schmidt, they're helping out. They're doing full court press, which we don't mind. I don't know why we turned it over last time. We just, I don't know, freaked out for something. And then there's a foul on number three. That's their little point guard. He has two points so far. It's four to four, just under, one tick under, two minutes left in the first quarter. Willie going to get him set to take it out. That's the first team foul, by the way, for the Rockets. First for we have one, they have one. Jack has it. He's posting up high, about 70 feet. Nice shot, fake drives with the left hand. Bucket. Beautiful Great. play by Big Jack. Great move. Schmidt with a deflection. He is the king of deflections. Rockets, they will keep substituting. They keep running this seven-man, maybe eight-man rotation. They pull out their big guy. Six to four in favor of the Norsemen. Rockets take it out. They've got it at the top of the key. Give it to the far wing. Back to the very bottom ring, and Stevie gets his hand caught in the cookie jar. Burlington's got their big guy out of the game now. Phil, I think it's time for Newark to look for that post play. I think Jack can score on these shorter guys that are guarding them now. It's time for Newark to recognize that these last two minutes of the quarter and take advantage of it. No question. Patrick checks in for Stevie. Patrick gets a deflection right away, almost gets a steal. They do a floater bucket. It's all tied up, 6-6, six, six, a buck 35 remaining. Willie's got it, some token pressure, nothing doing. Behind his back, drives, gives it off to Dylan. Dylan just checked in. Norseman wearing their tournament black. Dylan drives, gets it swatted. Here come the Rockets. Jack grabs it, and they call a foul. And the fans like that. Anytime a big guy gets a foul called on him, one of their best players, for whatever reason, the fans just cheer. Everybody always wants to call a foul on the big guy, Phil. <laughs> you know, I was a little guy, so I was okay with that. <laughs> I still am a little guy, <laughs> at least in height. <laughs> Burlington Central getting set to shoot two free throws. First one is good. I think these are the first free throws of the game, if I'm right. Seven to six, minute 17 left. Stands are filling up, more people waiting at the line. Second shot, ready. And that one's good as well, two of two. They hit, the Rockets take an early two point lead. Schmidt, Evan gets it into Schmidt, gives it back to Willie. Willie patient, getting it, dishes it over to Dylan. Dylan drives, got D on him, gives it off to Willie. Willie driving in, looking. Looking, a lot of contact, gives it off to Dylan. Dylan over to Schmidt. Schmidt had Jack for a second, doesn't get it to him. Over to Dylan. Dylan likes speed in the post. Over to Willie. Willie looking. Norseman running a play. A lot of contact. Jack pulls up from 15. Nothing doing. Dylan saves it. Could have thrown at Willie, but he didn't see him. Nice hustle by Dylan to get back. And he drives right in, and they foul someone. Oh, man. Count the bucket, fouls on 24, Evan, Evan Schomer, that's his first. Fourth team foul, four, four to one in fouls. The Rockets will shoot one free throw and it's good. They are three for three from the line, 11 to six, 39 seconds remaining. Dylan's got it, drives over the line. He's got someone coming behind, Schmidt has it, looking for the three, nothing doing, gives off to Dylan. Dylan thought about a three himself, gives over to Willie on the far side. We'd like to get a post up here. They're running more of a zone action. Schmidt has it, gives it off to Willie. 25 seconds remaining in the first quarter. Skip pass to Dylan. Dylan, two point, 15 footer. Remy, no. Just can't buy a bucket in this first quarter. Nice drive by the Rockets, coast to coast. Coach Tollison can't be happy with that. 13 to six, nine seconds, eight seconds. Willie's got it in his hand. Seven, six, five, four. Willie, one on one. Three, two. And that's the end of the first quarter, 13 to six.
13 to 6, a seven point lead for the.